guess I better get started. I really don't recall these new uniforms being advertised in the weekly email, but here we are. Um, hey Lauren, have you seen the extra rules for the receipt machine? Uh, no, sorry. I'm just here to grab my water bottle. I forgot it here yesterday after my shift. Maybe check in the storage room if you can't find any up front. Oh, yeah, yeah, n no worries. I'll have another look. Maybe I missed them. Well, hopefully you find them, but I really gotta run, so I'll see you later. I guess I'm doing cash alone today then. Hopefully it won't be too busy. Now seriously, where did those rolls go? I can't give anybody receipts if there isn't any paper. I guess I'll check the back. Okay. Good thing we don't open until 9. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's nice to be able to grab coffee before coming in. Ah! Where did you come from? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. I've been promoted, I guess you could say, to cashier. I used to just be a stock guy, but today they said I was going to be on cash, so here I am. Oh, and I'm Felix, by the way. Yeah, I, I guess that explains why you're here. I didn't mean to jump at you, I just... I thought I was working alone today. So, uh, sorry. And I'm Valerie. Well, it's nice to meet you. <laughs> And yeah, I don't usually stalk near the front, so it makes sense that you wouldn't have seen me before. Also, I really dig your uniform. You kind of remind me of those uh, rag dolls that people used to buy in retail stores and toy stores. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's nice to meet you too, but I think the word you're looking for is clown. <laughs> I, I don't really see the resemblance. At least you look like a teddy bear with the teddy bear hat and the bow tie. At least you look nice. <laughs> yeah, I do really dig the teddy bear look. And, well, I'm also a huge sucker for a good beanie hat, so it's honestly a win-win for me. But even if you don't like your uniform, I still think it looks cool. No, Michael, I told you, you can't have every color variant of Mr. Roboman. You have to pick one, and only one. But mom, the green one comes with extra ping pong balls that shoot from his hands. He's so cool. <sighs> what am I going to do with you? Gosh, I wonder if that hunk of a lion works here. <sighs> What? Oh, um, I said, I wonder if they still have those trunks with the lines on them. You know, f for my nephew. So he can store things in it. <laughs> um, right. <sighs> Women. Who can understand them? I wonder if they have Legos, or dollies, or mallow bears, or oh look, mommy, they have giant teddy bears. I want one, I want one, I want one, I want one! Please slow down, Allison. I can't jump as fast as you. Uh, gee, I didn't expect there to be so many people in here today. Good thing there's two of us. I'll say, but a number of them are actually regulars, so I do see them about once a week. Oh good, you're on cash today. Call me predictable if you will, but I do like coming to ring in my orders with you because you always know how to do it just right. No offense to this fellow, but the person I had last week he didn't even know how to give me a receipt with my order. Anyways, um, oh, they must have been on the other side. I have a couple of teddy bears I'm buying for my nephews. <laughs> yes, I had noticed that you do always come to my cash when you're in. Oh, and in case you didn't know, the mini bears are on sale right now for half price. Oh, yes, I actually had noticed that. That's why I'm buying um, one for each of my nephews. Their birthday is next month and they're twins, so I wanted to get them the same one, so hopefully they won't fight over them. Sounds nice. I'm sure they'll enjoy them. Um, will you be paying with debit, credit, or cash? 
Hmm, better make it debit, dear. I try not to use my credit card too much in one day. Alrighty, the machine should be ready for you whenever you're ready, and I'll bag up those teddy bears for you. Would you like a gift receipt with those because they are a present for your nephews? Well, yes, I, I better take one just in case they don't like the colors or something, so that would be great, thank you. Sounds good. I've tucked the receipts um, in the bag with the bears for you, so uh, have a nice day. You too, Valerie. I'll see you again soon. I'll take it she's one of the regulars. <laughs> yeah, she's always in here um, pretty often buying things for her nieces and nephews and other various family members. Her children are all pretty much grown up, so they don't really come in here. Maybe everyone will just go to your cash then and I'll be stuck here with nobody to bring in. <laughs> oh, well I wouldn't count on that. There's still plenty of people in the store. Would you like a receipt in your bag, miss? Uh, no thank you. I highly doubt my son will be returning this because he's been asking for one for weeks. <laughs> Could have at least got me the green one because you said I couldn't have all of them. Hey now, mister, you're lucky that I bought you one at all. Besides, the green one costs more because it comes with the extras you talked about. Those ping pong balls. That's what makes it a jillion times cooler, because he shoots them from his hands. And the one that you bought me doesn't do that. I guess I'll just have to pretend that it does. Hmm. Hey now, mister. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, have a nice day. Get back here. You can't leave the store without me. <laughs> Looks like you're getting the hang of it. I think so, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I saw a kid giving me the stink eye earlier, so I'm hoping he doesn't come this way. <laughs> Some kids can be brutal, so hopefully not. <laughs> oh, by the way, it's uh, actually my break, so I'll see you back here in 20. See ya. <sighs> Dang it. Apparently I've been relieved for break two. There was a mess up with the schedule for today, so Leanne told me just to take my break now and that Liam would cover me. Huh, that's odd. I don't think that happens very much, or very rarely. Yeah, it is an odd mix-up, but I'm not too fussy, as long as I get to eat my bagel. I'm all good. Do, do you mind if I join you? Oh, uh, no, feel free to sit wherever you'd like. Since you work in a toy store, what's your favorite toy? <laughs> That's a good question. Do you mean like a toy from here? From from the store? N no, it doesn't have to be from here. Unless your favorite toy just so happens to be from here. But really just in general. Well then, I guess I'd have to go with this doll I had as a kid. She had a really nice mint dress. I got her for my seventh birthday. And she stole my room uh, somewhere. It... It wasn't from here, though, I don't think. I don't really know where my parents got it, but I've never seen one here, so I don't think we sell them. <laughs> this sounds really special. You'll have to make sure that you display her somewhere or put her out somewhere. Somewhere where you can see her, at least. Well, now that you mention it, I'm pretty sure she's actually on one of my shelves. I just sometimes forget that she's there. Uh, and what about you? What's your favorite toy? Teddy bears. Teddy bears without a doubt. I had quite a few growing up, like a small collection. I used to bring them everywhere, in my treehouse, in the car. I just liked bringing them on adventures. They were a lot of fun. That's nice. I hope you still have them. Or maybe you display them somewhere, because it's definitely a nice keepsake. Unfortunately, my parents never bought me a teddy bear. It's not like they didn't care or anything, because I had the doll and other toys, but for some reason, they thought that I would lose it or outgrow it too soon, so they didn't buy me one. But it's it's just how it was. Oh, that's terrible. I mean, everyone deserves a teddy bear. Plus, it's kind of a lousy reason, in my opinion, not to buy you one. I mean, you don't seem like the kind of person that would just lose it anyway. But hey, I'm not them, so I guess they thought it was a good enough reason. And, you know, you could always still buy one. We have lots in the store, which I'm sure you already knew. Especially those mini ones, they're pretty cute. Uh, I don't know, I feel like I'm a bit old to buy myself a teddy bear. I mean, I'm a teenager, so I feel like I kind of surpassed my time. Oh, well, I wouldn't necessarily say that. I don't think there's really much of an age to put on a teddy bear, but I, I see what you're trying to say. I mean, maybe you could sneak one home sometime. 
in your bag or something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Whew, that was a lot of people in today. And it's not even a holiday. I know I said there was a lot of regulars, but it feels like half the city was in here today. Definitely. In here I thought maybe sometimes you'd have it easy as a cashier, but I guess I was wrong. Often not, but occasionally we do have a few slow days. Especially when it's not near a holiday. <laughs> do you regret betting, getting put on cash? <laughs> not at all. If I hadn't put on, been put on cash, then I wouldn't have met you. And you're honestly lots of fun. <laughs> well, I don't know about that, but it's been a lot of fun working with you too. It's... Nice. I don't always have this much fun as a cashier. Oh, uh, before you go, I have something for you. For me? I... Y you got something for me? Yeah. I had to be kind of sneaky about it. So you know how I was said earlier I had to use the washroom before I met you back at the cash? Well, I was really just going off to get, uh, this. You... You got me a teddy bear? Well, everyone deserves a teddy bear, including you. When you said you never had one, well, I couldn't let you go without experiencing the joy of a good old teddy bear. And I hope you like the color. I swear I didn't get you the pink one because you're a girl. How... How did you pay for this? Oh, it was really quite easy, actually. I got Tammy at the balloon station to take my money for it, and she's gonna bring the money up with the cash later along to the cash later, along with her money from the balloon sales. I, I couldn't risk you seeing me paying for it at the, my own cash, so I, I asked her if she'd take it for me. I, I, I'm, I'm speechless. I can't believe you did all that just to get me a teddy bear. Thank you. And, and the color's great. I, I do like pink, it's my second favorite color, but I don't know what to say. Uh, how about this? Uh, wanna be friends? Um, I'm sorry if that's too direct. No, 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 I... I'd love to be friends. I guess we're... <laughs> teddy bear friends. <laughs> yeah, how about that? My first teddy bear friend. 